following report pertains to the discovery of various recordings found at the residence of the late Howard Phillips Lovecraft in Providence, Rhode Island during the early 1940s. Initial interactions with the recordings have led some personnel to exhibit irrational behaviors, including but not limited to self-harm, deranged outbursts, otherworldly madness, cannibalism, homicidal rages, and unexplained fatalities. No personnel should view the recordings in their entirety. Short controlled viewings with mandatory psychological evaluations in between have been instituted. Forensic analysis raises more questions than answers. Although the reels appear consistent with materials from the 1920s, they exhibit anomalous properties. Certain frames, when isolated, depict imagery that seems to fluctuate or change upon each viewing, rendering a concrete analysis near impossible. The nature of the recordings and the source of their influence remains an enigma. It has been theorized that the recordings tap into a potential primal fear or forbidden knowledge that the human mind is ill-equipped to handle or comprehend. On multiple occasions, agents have reported that the tapes don't play the same sequence of events consistently. Scenes change, entities appear and disappear, and most alarmingly, sometimes agents who've previously viewed the tapes claim they've seen themselves within the footage even if they've never been near the locations shown. Comparisons with Lovecraft's literary works are ongoing. Preliminary reviews suggest a disturbing overlap with his described eldritch entities. This hints at the possibility that his writings might not have been entirely fictional, if at all. Storing the tapes has presented its own challenges, electronic equipment in their vicinity often starts to malfunctions. Several storage facilities have reported inexplicable drops in temperature and a persistent fog or mist forming near the containment units. This has led to the decision to keep the tapes in a specially constructed vault with multiple security layers. It is of utmost concern that if these recordings were to fall into public hands or be harnessed malevolently, the consequences could be catastrophic. All measures must be taken to secure and contain the tapes. Limited and controlled exposure for research purposes is being debated by the NIB. The recordings present a significant threat, both in terms of psychological harm and potential misuse. Until we can fully understand the origin and the power contained within these tapes, all personnel are advised to exercise extreme caution and adhere to instituted protocols. If any personnel starts to feel or hear things out of the ordinary after viewing these tapes, please contact the...